So we got a truck now to haul Topsy to Ontario. So we need to make a loading ramp. Um, it's a step deck, so it doesn't have ramps. Didn't find an RGN or like a low bed. So we're gonna run to Norgard's concrete, grab some concrete blocks, dig a hole in the ground and make our own loading ramps. You know, it's kind of how Edison does it. Okay, we got some concrete blocks here, lock blocks from Norgard. So we're gonna take these back to the barn there and make a loading ramp so that on tomorrow we can get this truck loaded up. did it we now have a loading ramp that's how you build a loading ramp real easy what took us about two hours that wasn't very expensive what i guess it's 450 Four, bucks 420 420 420 bucks yes yeah, she charges 420 69 420 dollars and 69 cents right um, that's how much it costs to build a loading ramp in Merritt. Perfect. And now people uh, definitely complained about and saw our struggles with the CH logistics and the uh, and the loading of the trailer. So we now have somewhat made it a little easier for future endeavors. Hopefully. Yeah. Well, I mean, then we can back whatever we need into in there, and hopefully, if we get, ever get a forklift or a skid steer or something like that, we'll be able to actually unload trailers. So we're getting Topsy now, lining them up for the low bed on Friday morning. Yeah. Well, we'll get Topsy lined up here, and, and we'll put it on the low bed.
quiet when it moves. Topsy has not changed its height. It's still ten and a half feet. Got to figure out what his deck height is. Hey, this is Suk with Lowrider Transport. We are hauling up uh, a truck going from uh, Mirrored BC to Georgetown, Ontario. And I have Instagram Lowrider379. Just check me out on Instagram while riding this. Hey, I'm here with our buddy Suk here and this beautiful Peter Bell. Uh, what year is this truck? This is 1998. 1998, so pre-log then. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, how long have you had this thing? This thing is beautiful. Um, I had it this for five years. Five years. Wow. Yeah, I built it myself. You built this yourself? Yeah. Wow. Like all the, yeah. like I love how you've matched the floors, yeah. <laughs> the bullet switches, like, yeah. yeah. This is exactly, exactly how a Peterbilt should be done out. Yeah. Like for a highway truck, this thing is beautiful. Yeah. We weren't gonna just let anybody haul Topsy. You actually like passed a heavy screening. <laughs> yeah. There was a yeah, yeah. We we're like, okay, hey, we need somebody. I'm like, it, it gotta have a long nose Peterbilt, long nose Kenworth, gotta be a good solid boy. Yeah, this is the one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I said like it's gotta be like E log example. I'm like, yeah, don't <laughs> tell me if you've got an E log on the way to Ontario. You'll get oh, that yeah. truck moving. Like that's this is the way old school trucking should be. Yeah. It should be clear. 43. Okay, you're gonna show me your horns here. You got some custom horns? Yeah. Nice! <laughs> That's awesome! <laughs> 